Well, of course, billing departments have always had insurance accounts receivable groups, but now patient account receivable is becoming a larger issue, and it's quite a different ballgame. You see, these people have to talk directly to the patients rather than talking with insurance representatives. And oftentimes they have to educate the patient on what a deductible even is. This is a problem that is starting to grow and grow and grow. And my fear is that if practices don't start to get a handle on it, it's going to get out of control. Of course, there's no magic formula for how you deal with patient follow-ups. A lot of groups send two letters, then call once, and then send them on to collections. Some send one letter, then call, then send another letter, and then send them to collections. There's, there's really no great way to do it. The only bad formula is letter, 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 with no end in sight. So some little tricks of the trade are first, Call if it's over a certain amount, whether it be $300 or $500. Determine that and then go forward, but be consistent. Second, always sort the patient owed amounts from high to low and work them in that order. That way you're always sure to get the highest amounts first and then the low ones you can work on as needed. Third, a CRM or customer relationship manager system is advised. It can be as simple as an Excel spreadsheet or as complicated as one of these large online systems that helps salespeople uh, track their calls. You need to know who called the patient, when they called the patient, and how their balance was discussed. Fourth, when you're working payment plans, it's always best to keep it within a three month window. Try to get them to pay half up front and then a quarter the next month and then a quarter the month after that. If they can do that, then they'll have enough time to pay their balance. And of course, you can adjust it as needed. If it's a higher balance, then you can move it to six months uh, or, or longer if you have to. All trends are pointing towards this being a growing issue in the industry. And if you don't get your ducks in a line right now, it's going to become an issue more and more down the road.